How to prevent working channel failure. Confirm that the needle is fully retracted and that the needle is securely locked with a needle adjuster lever. During insertion of the needle, always keep the endoscope in the neutral straight position. Do not use angulation during insertion. Confirm that the connector sits firmly on the adapter biopsy valve. Make sure that the pull tab of the single-use adapter biopsy valve fits in the slit of the connecting slider. Otherwise, the handle may not be properly connected and disconnected. Connect the needle system to the endoscope by pushing the connecting slider of the needle over the sleeve of the adapter biopsy valve and confirm that the handle section is firmly secured to the endoscope. Care has to be taken that the needle sheath is inserted far enough distally so that it extends beyond the end of the instrument channel. The adjustment is done by loosening the sheath adjuster knob and slowly advancing the sheath while the sheath position is monitored in the endoscopic image. Only the distal part of the needle sheath should be seen in the endoscopic image, crescent. Once the correct sheath length is found, rotate the connector section so that the handle is easy to hold and securely tighten the sheath adjuster knob by turning it clockwise. Before withdrawing the needle system from the endoscope, ensure that the following steps are completed. Straighten the endoscope completely. Fully retract the needle slider until a click is heard. Confirm that you can see the control line on the needle scale. Securely fix the needle slider using the needle adjuster lever in order to prevent accidental exposure of the needle.